Hold right there and give her the beans. <laughs> I got Maxi's too. You need to get your drink open. <laughs> This is one of the craziest trips I've been on. In the hood. What do you got? Uh, just an alternator, you know. Dude. That's gnarly. Last little bit. Oh my god. Whoa! Toyo Tower. We're getting some like warning lights on the dash. I think we're gonna have to tow. Tow? It's a pretty wild angle. Uh, oh. Macaroni and cheese. We've got a nice juicy ribeye going here. What are you doing over here with the freaking March Madness? <laughs> How'd that happen? She's a wee bit dusty, boys. That was ridiculous. It is 10.04. Oh! What's up guys? I just made it and I uh, met up with the rest of the Backwoods crew. And we got our buddy Josh from Tennessee. Uh, he's a, a new Backwoods ambassador. He's coming with us on this content trip. So this whole thing we're doing um, like a Backwoods content trip and uh, we're gonna watch the solar eclipse out here cause it's, it's going right where we wheel, like right in the Ozarks. Um, and we're calling it Toyo Tality. You can thank Mo for that name. Stoked. We got J.O. and his brand new meats and then Josh over there I'll show you guys all the rigs later but gonna let some uh, air out real quick and we'll get going So we're setting up for a shot real quick. There's this crossing right here. Sometimes it's pretty deep and we don't know how deep it is right now. J.O. doesn't have a snork, so just to be safe, he's just gonna do this one over here. Actually, it doesn't even look deep at all. Yeah, it's pretty sweet, huh? 
I just told him where not to go. Oh, I hit that rock. That's what I hit. Right in the middle like a Dumbo. Josh got a little love tap here. What do you have to say about that? Part of the fun. Part of it, man. Well, I took the world's worst line on that. That's for sure. Did I hit my hitch, you said? Yeah. Oh, yeah, right there. What do we got going on here? Oh, uh, just, you know, banging it back in. <laughs> Done just like a true Toyota owner. <laughs> That's yeah, mint. Yeah. Oh, I got the e brake on. No way. <laughs> Doing pig things. Diff made a little diff drag spot for me. Yeah. <laughs> Man, you I, can do it. I thought I had it. Hold right there and give it the beans. Go back farther and more beans. Yeah. Is <laughs> it just for drive shaft or what? Yeah, there's like a little, there's a dig right here where your front tire spins, where everybody's front tire spins. Now you got a huge tree in the way. Yeah. Dude, I hate it. I itched my nose with your what? phone. I, I think I got most of it. Well, we're going. Yeah. Yeah. Here's what we know. Can't see the rapid. No, lay down. See it hooks you up. <laughs> Time to set up. How can I open that? might be a jumbled mess oh yeah this went flying everywhere i forgot to strap that down very cool I got maxis too. You need to get your drink open. <laughs> Let's see that cup. Yeah. Could have used these on that hill. <laughs> yeah, get those wet, wet wipes out. <laughs> Dude, you gotta stay clean, man. You gotta stay clean. Do you know how good this feels? After all that dust? <sighs> Peachy.
Got to get in the ears too. Hmm. This is basically the trail shower. Oh, it's cucumber and mint. <laughs> Dialed. So did you find a surprise in your tent? Uh, What's the deal? Ah, oh, dude, tent soaking wet. What? Don't buy cheap tents. Hey, you can see all the mildew up there. Whoa. Yeah. When was the last time you had it open? Uh, about a, two months ago. Jeez. Should probably air it out every once in a while. Is it like in the mattress? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, dude. Completely soaked on the other, underside of it. But, that's all right. Very not it's cool. All right. Josh is part of the No Fender Club now. But he brought some spare clips. Because he knows. It doesn't matter. It's nice and bent now. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's not even going back. No. That's incredible. That's okay. It's a common forearm problem. Well, 37's problem. Yeah. You got the spare in here? Yeah, but it fell down. <laughs> <laughs> Classic. What's Mo doing up here? What are you doing? Making them outside. <laughs> what are you doing? I see a foot. Fair enough. Dude, what do you think the odds are that spare isn't in the same place it was ratcheted? <laughs> Dude, nothing in that bed stays in the same place. I'm telling you. you know that. It fell. <laughs> you planned this, right? Just like this campsite being here, yeah. right at 5.30, 5.45. Yeah, I mean, on your schedule, yeah. Yeah. Got here a little earlier, so that's why I didn't have these lights out and stuff. No big deal. You got camera dude over here. What are you setting up? I'm trying to get this balanced because I have it with the mic on. Oh. Sweet. Drew's the man. All the sweet photos you see on the website. Thank Drew Downs. We call him Drew Downs. Well, Mo calls him Drew Downs. We all followed. Everyone calls him Drew Downs. We made it. Do you guys think awnings tonight for rain? Is that a thing? I want to, but then when I hear about tornado winds, I'm like, mm, one hole in the side of my ink cover seems like plenty. <laughs> or packing it up wet. Show up right when they're supposed to. Good sight, man. This is a good spot. We've got a nice juicy ribeye going here on the jet boil. Got a tried and true salt and pepper, and then I like to put a little bit of this triple lock on there. Pretty good. I'm on number two, old fashioned. These are so amazing. You said you're doing brats, Drew? Yeah, I'm gonna do brats. <laughs> nice. Some pepper jack. Yeah, That's awesome, dude. It's gonna be good. What are y'all cooking over here? Steaks? Burgers that accidentally might have 
broken apart. And oh, bum skis. Mess them up. But they're still going to taste They're going to taste fine. Gonna taste I've fine. got three cheeseburgers coming my way. Basically Dude. Irregularly you say you have it. Try. What are you doing over here with the freaking March Madness? <laughs> How'd that happen? What are you doing? <laughs> How'd that even happen? But that's convenient. It is convenient. Wow. <laughs> I guess. That, Whoops. Sure, sure, we'll watch that, I guess. <laughs> like, you got your full bar right here. Literally, look at all this stuff. Holy crap. It's terrible. That's what's in Jeez. this. That's what's in this, huh? Your your bar. <laughs> it's good. <laughs> that's hilarious. Yeah, it's a rough life out here. Yeah, looks pretty terrible. <laughs> Josh, what are you cooking, dude? I'm going to make a BLT. Ooh, BLT, that sounds good. Got the Blackstone? Yeah. Nice. That's the way to do it. That's the trick. It's heavy, though. Yeah. It is heavy. Let's see what J.O. is making over here. They were good games. Man, it smells good through here. What do you got going, J.O.? Man, I got some broccoli, chicken alfredo. Heck yeah. Yeah, you want some? I'm good, man. I got mine going. I got a little ribeye going. Heck yeah, dude. Heck yeah. You March Madnessing too? Joe Rogan. Oh, heck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I listened to Joe Rogan on the way here. Oh, yeah. Me too. I'm finishing it up. Let's go see how this steak's doing. Probably awesome. Got some Irish butter in there. I think it'll be very decent. All right, dinner is served. We got our ribeye, looking awesome. Got some Long Island, it's gonna be good. Gonna go by the fire. I think uh, everybody's getting kind of close on there. Gonna eat this thing up. What's up, just waking up. Coffee's on, last night was money. Um, best weather in a, I've had in a long time camping out here. And no diesel heater required. I think J.O. is making some. J.O., there he is. There Dude, look. Hand delivered, man. There's your biscuits, dude. Thanks so much, bro. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look at this. Those look amazing. He's got his little scottle. You made this, right? Huh? You made the scottle, right? I didn't make the scottle. Hand I forged? No. Yeah. Cool. You made this, the base plate, though. Yeah. Or whatever. Yeah. It's so cool. Yeah. And this is from Southwest Disc. It was like 50 bucks online. Nice. Nice and easy. I like it. Dude, beer mosas? You want one? Shoot. Yeah, I think so. All right, cool. I think so. I am going to drink this coffee, so. Go driver. What? Go driver on the wall. Like as far as driver as I can? Yeah, that's what J.O. did. Slow, yeah. Put it in low first if you're not already. I'm in low. Okay. You in first? I'm in first. Yeah. All right, cool. Thank you. 
It's a pretty wild angle. No, you're all right. You can go passenger, Drew. What? You can go passenger. I'm so stoked on this lighting. It's so rare we get good lighting. Mind of that tree? No, nah, you're gonna go under it. There you go. Passenger, you got room. Very nice. Passenger. Someone's got the bottom. <laughs> that was wild. This spot is really chunky. Holy cow. That's gnarly. Driver, driver. Woo! That was ridiculous. He was on the line. to film again. <laughs> I'm serious. There he is. The man. 
man himself. That's right. Oh, you know us. Uh, oh, macaroni and cheese. I think that's what I hit too. Bumper hit? Yeah, we hit the bumper. Is that the bumper? Look who it is. Mr. McClellan. What are the odds? How did you not hit the slider? Wow. running one camera my nose is fine Here a bit that washout section. Uh, it's been a while. It's, it's been probably it's have, sometime last year that I did. You'll have fun now. She's a wee bit dusty, boys. Crazy dusty. Man, that's epic looking. What are you doing? I gotta get this dog some water. Even though it's dusty, she insists on riding with the window. We gotta crank down. Look at this dirty face. Alright, I think J.O. has a little issue. What do you got going? Uh, both my CVs are loose, like moving in and out for some reason. Can you do that again? <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. Yeah, I just want to make sure. That's good. Make sure I know how to do that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's weird, though. Like, Factory Yoda Jack. Oh gosh. Yeah, that, that'll work just good. All right, so this is a competition of how many Jacks can we get out here? One, two, three. Dude, look at that. Safe Jack for the win. Do you want it tall? You think you want it taller than that? I've got a taller extension. Now check your CV. Did it actually turn? Didn't feel like it, but. It's got a sweet shot of your butt, J.O. Yeah. <laughs> Times three. Yeah, I zoomed in. Now is normal, so you're you're good.
some good content. Oof. I hope that truck's clean as a whistle. Babe. getting some like warning lights on the dash for electrical and we think it's because of all this junk in there so I'm gonna try to pull as much of this out as I can and then hit it with some WD-40 to get the water out that's in there but yeah it's it's just caked and nastiness big score big score like dead pine needles all right i don't know if i've given a proper video update in a while the truck uh the shop truck alternator is this toast like it is we're limping this thing along like every i don't know a few hundred yards or so because the the battery's dying and we have this little portable jump pack we're like relatively close to a campsite so we're gonna go there and, and um, hook up our starlink and call some local like o'reilly's um Maybe one in Dover or so, because we're close to Dover. See if they have a starter, or sorry, a uh, alternator. And if they do, um, we'll pull it tonight at camp and then we will go get it in the morning and then put it in. I'm pretty dang sure it's the alternator because it just, the truck just completely, the truck completely uh, shuts off when he's driving. Hey Mo, how far is camp? Well, there's one that he's trying to, we're trying to get to, I don't know, not very far. And then, like I said, there's one just down that road that I came off of um, on the right that's got a camp ring, flattish. I think we're going to have to tow. Tow? Yeah. Good practice. Brett. What's up, Taz? I put my finger in front. Ready? Come on. Okay, come on. Where do you want to stop? Keep going. All right, here's an update. This is one of the craziest trips I've been on in a while. Um, yeah, truck is totally dead and we hooked up Starlink. Check this out. This is hilarious. <laughs> right over here. I hooked up Starlink. I'm powering it with my little EcoFlow, but literally on the river. We have some decent open sky and, uh, we called a bunch of parts places around here. Found an O'Reilly's or advanced. I can't remember at this point. Anyway, I, I bought one. I ordered one. And it's gonna be there hopefully like 9.30 in the morning. So we're gonna pull the alternator tonight, take it out, um, and then I'm gonna leave in the morning to go get it, uh, you know, kind of early. So hopefully I get the part, we can come back, slap it on, and uh, keep going. Um, I'll keep it updated as much as I can, but it's actually really hard to, you know, film when I'm doing a bunch of this stuff. Still having a good time though. It's golden hour and um, this is a content trip. So we still got to get content. So we're going to try that real quick. So I'm going to go jump on the tools and help Josh pull this thing out. Yeah, there's not a big throw with that either. What do you got? What? What do you got? Uh, just an alternator, you know. 
Dude. Typical. We did Typical it. Typical stuff on the trail. Hey, just like that fan, he said, give me that Amazing. Two different lifestyles going on here. This looks killer. Dutch oven that she doesn't know about also. I specifically no, told Mo to not put it on top. Ah, you said this that is, now. This is documented right now. You said that now. Yeah. When I started you said it's fine. No, nope, never said that. So sweet, we'll be getting a new one. That's good. We'll see you home with some cobra. <laughs> All right, guys, it is 10.04. J.O. came in super clutch for us. Got the alternator. We got two bolts in. We'll put the battery back in and jump it and run it for a long time. Alternator's in. Moment of truth. Woo! That's amazing. 11 o'clock. Yes! What a freaking victory. Alright, for our reward, we got Peach Cobbler. Look at that. Thank you, Mo and Mariah. Yes, Y'all are the best. Nothing like a 1115 Cobbler yeah. sesh. <laughs> That's right. So I've been using Onyx Off-Road for about two years now. And one of my favorite things that I continue to use all the time is this offline maps feature. So if you go over here to the left menu bar, you can click new offline map, and then you get this little rectangle where you can drag and move it around to select which area you wanna actually download directly to your device. So you can select from low, medium, or high resolution. We'll do medium and we'll name this Canyon City. And now after you click save, you have this entire area downloaded directly to your device. So whether you have service or not, you're going to always have that peace of mind. You know where you're going to go. So if you guys want to try this out, you can use my coupon code ARC OFFROAD for 20% off. Thanks, guys. Let's get back to the video. Buenos freaking DS. Man, last night slept. So good. Still, we are so excited that the truck started. Like, seriously, the biggest win ever. And shout out to Trail Tacoma and Mr. Elon Musk. So, you know, hooked up the, the Starlink. And then we got on and looked at the Trail Tacoma website of how to change an alternator. And we did it. We're still riding high. Feels good. We're breaking down. We're pretty much ready right now. Um, here's that antenna that broke for a second time. Good old aluminum. Just didn't get a good weld on it, but it's riding right there. Scratching my Bajas. Really cool. All right, we found a freaking awesome spot. I don't think anyone's going to be here um, to see the eclipse. It's 12.15, and check this out. We're at this beautiful spot right here, and there's a decent clearing. So we're going to get some photos and stuff up here. But uh, this would have been an amazing campsite, but there's no way we, we would have towed the truck all the way back here. It's about lunchtime, so get a little sandwich or something. There's a lot of things that went wrong on this trip, but there's also a lot of things that went right. Like, you know, where we broke down and you know, finding this campsite, the weather is perfect, no rain. It's not hot, it's not cold. I'm gonna do a completely separate video with Josh. We're gonna do a walk around uh, of his Forerunner. Um, so yeah, check that out on the channel. I don't know which one's gonna be published first, but this thing's a freaking mammoth, so we're gonna do that. All right, we're waiting on the solar eclipse. 
in the water. Mo is being miserable over there. What? What? <laughs> Shout out to Jesse Orland Chef, literally the best granola on this earth. pretty close to it being the eclipse. I don't know if you can tell, it's already like shaded. It's already kind of getting shaded. I'm gonna turn the phone around and try to put it in these glasses and see if you can see it. Oh, you can't really see. Mo said to come Toyo Talatize over there. Mo's in his own. <laughs> Josh, are you able to like capture it on your phone? I can't really. Feels like there's a filter on the, the camera or something. Mo, did you get it right? Joy Talent, I did. I did get it right. That's good. I'm glad we found this sweet spot. Sunny shade. Oh, look how dark. It's like visually getting darker. Look how crazy weird. Insanity. Hey, you can see it. Whoa! That is so brass, or something. Oh my god. Here it comes. Yeah. Just Barely, barely starting to poke out. Look outside. Holy cow. It's like a street light. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is like a street light. Well, that was crazy cool. Definitely, definitely a first. It's already starting to lighten up again. Yeah, it's like cooled off significantly, but it's like 68 degrees right now. Very cool. <laughs> Low. Got the drone pulled in. Excellent work, drone pilot. Very nice. Well, I'm sitting here editing this video and uh, completely forgot to do an outro because we were having such a good time. So here's your glorious formal, very formal outro. Um, seriously, thank you guys for watching. Uh, you know, if you made it to the end of this video and you're watching me say all this stuff, that means a ton because you sticked, sticked stuck around the whole time. Um, yeah, seriously, feel so fortunate to be able to see a once in a lifetime, pretty much uh, total solar eclipse in our backyard in the woods. Crazy fortunate, crazy awesome. So appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, we'll see you in the next video.